All right, guys, welcome back to another segment. You know, the world normally do it. And I'm always here to give you update that concerns Chelsea and Chelsea alone. All right, first of all, we'll start with um, Andre Santos' deal was cut off, it was not fulfilled. The loan did not pull through or come to that. And also, Chelsea are targeting a new wonder kid, he's just 15 years old, an Aquadian player, he's a midfielder. That one aside, then. Todd Bodley and Co. want to follow the process they use in the Dodgers to follow it up on Chelsea. As in the, the same pattern where they use build Dodgers, now they want to build Chelsea. Alright, but before I go into everything I want to say in details, please kindly like this video, share, and most importantly, don't forget to subscribe to this channel because on this channel, I only give you update that concerns Chelsea and Chelsea alone. First of all, I will start with Andre santos remember i told you guys that santos was supposed to go to palmeris on a loan deal on a loan deal not on a permanent deal they are not signing him he's going there on a loan deal due to the fact that his working permit was not accepted in england it was rejected after multiple times as chelsea have tried to work on that for him but it was not accepted so instead of keeping the player hanging they decided to place him on a loan deal to palmeris and that deal did not pull through. Let me read this tweet for you guys from Absolute Chelsea. Um, he said that Palmeiras have given up on the signing Andre Santos on loan. Chelsea demand the midfielder release for the Under-20 World Cup and also his return to England on July 1st. Maybe with my with this statement we had this year, I believe I say the Palmeiras on their own, so there's no one making come out like nobody say as he come then july 1st they'll come release her you understand be like the initial agreement we then get between them them and primary is need the enter way that is why i believe i say the deal pull off you understand so since you don't pull off now could see if anything will happen any die minutes option if you have in the sense we say in work permit fits come through or they have to look for another club for him that he's going to go on loan for so as for andre santos since he they hang for now because of in loan to primary is not put through and the work permits to no put through so he's still they pending then i guess you guys saw that news yesterday on different social media platforms both on blogs and on twitter and everywhere that chelsea are closing according to absolute chelsea again see that chelsea are closing in on a verbal agreement with independent deal via to sign 15 year old kendry pierce a deal is close to being completed he will be able to join chelsea when he turned 18. well all these young young players which is just a sign he good though i'm not just saying no good it's good it's good that at least that they sign young players that they try one build the team the circumference of young young players and i'm not disputing the fact but the thing is that the ones that we will not we will not sign we never see see results you understand but i believe they will go see results very soon but i'm just okay with the fact that we are all in all our dealing now young young players and then they sign you understand you know go see anybody we we would they are with the answer everybody young 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 very soon now this as in zakaya and we they go for very soon now chelsea go pull up for that deal if care is not taken chelsea go pull up for that guy deal very soon you understand and also this guy just go divide Josco divadio did just go divide to still one come england he still one come play for chelsea now I'm making never extend the con. He still want come play for Chelsea. All in mind, they for Chelsea. I don't know why that deal will not be put through initially, Sha. But we could just see how this summer transfer will be because definitely I believe say Chelsea owner go see make another woeful amount splashing this summer because they will still spend more this summer for transfer. You understand? Then I remember I told you guys that um the way where they carry build dodgers now they want carry build chelsea you understand dodgers you know say that but the follow gets dodger dodgers dodgers now basket and a baseball baseball team you understand not be a football team on a baseball so now according to vinks he said that 
I see similar pattern at Chelsea. The squad could take three years challenge for the title in being honest. They built from ground zero and they know that at Chelsea they won't take profit until 2032. They are following the same pattern that they lead, led to Dodgers domination. Okay. Let me read the first one. Bolly and his people are very patient as long as they think their project is on track. They they bought Dodgers in 2012, finished 13 in MLB, signed young players, had slow and steady progress until 2017. And when they won the league and they haven't finished below second since 2009-19. Well, see, uh, to be honest, uh, you cannot compare a baseball team to a football team. Let's tell ourselves the truth. Chelsea is not is not Brighton. Chelsea is not West Ham that you are building. Chelsea has already been built. Despite the fact that we have this this mindset, we have this this life of changing coach for us to get our glory. You understand? For currently right now, nobody, no England club now they keep coach like seven, eight years again. Ah, yes, if they sign with you two, three years, you don't finish. No coach ready, they keep rich six, eight years again. Go and check for England. No coach ready, they reach that level again. As Pep now, Pep now, very soon the contract goes on. So I need to see it extend. How many years have been, they been give Pep? Was it four or five years? They're not given rich 10 years. Do you understand? I'm not against the rebuilding no, or trying to build Chelsea or do this thing. But my own is that the man that you pick for this job, for the building, is not the man for this project, which is Graham Potter. Do you understand? Tom Bradley would have been more patient with, with Thomas Tuku. I know, I know, say, Normally, that's the way no put through concerning Ronaldo and all the rest. So he be one do so that he go use and get more balance when it comes to money and sales of JC and all the rest. I know that one follow contribute to because since Tuchel not been support the buying of Ronaldo, that one follow affect and also personal issues between him and Todd Bodley too. That one they bought. Bota was not the right man that you can use in building Chelsea. And with the look of things, with the look of things, Chelsea is now Brighton Pro Max. Go and check records. I'm not against him building, like I said before, I'm not stopping him building the team to look like Dodgers. So, like I said, Dodgers is a baseball team. It's not a football team. You don't compare baseball and football. You buy young players for baseball, it's concerned football. Football is a different world entirely on its own. And not just football, it's not just football in America, it's football in England. It's a different thing. Go and check Potter's record when he was in Brighton in 2021, 2022. 23 goals, ninth position, 30 points. In Chelsea, 23 goals, 10th position, 31 points. After playing 20, uh, 20, uh, after match week 24, the same thing. No different. So if you if you are building a team, at least go for somebody that understands you. See, there's nothing like slow and steady. Slow and steady will go to championships. Slow and steady, you will lose your fan base. Slow and steady, you will lose sponsor deals. Slow and steady, you will lose the calibers of players that you are supposed to sign in the club. Slow and steady, some of the players that sign six, seven years in the club will be forced to terminate their contracts because they cannot stay in the club here by they are not playing Champions League. And some of these players, they have the eye of that. Uh, yes, they know that Chelsea win Champions League. They know that they are no, they have known Chelsea for success. They have known Chelsea for. For so many great things, and now you are coming to say you want to build Chelsea. Did they tell you that Chelsea need rebuilding? Even though you are building Chelsea, not with Potter. No, I disagree with on that one. Not with Potter. Yeah, because you bought Dodgers in 2012, and Dodgers was nowhere to be found. If, at least they say that at Dodgers, no, you know, been get name. You buy and when nothing comes out. 
he, he started building Dodgers, buying young players. He started seeing results based on the kind of people you brought in. And also the position where Dodgers was. You understand? Dodgers wanted success. Not before team we don't already see success. Where we say they want more success. There are two different things. That your principle, that your ideology, if you work for baseball but not in football, let's tell ourselves the truth. You can drop your comments. You understand? You can work in baseball but not in football. Football is a different world. Even though you want to build Chelsea, not with Potter. We have other coaches that can help in doing the, um, and in following this your vision, line of vision. So you want to build Chelsea. That is why you assign all the Brighton staff, everybody in Brighton, people that have low winning mentality to work with him. Why not leave some of the Chelsea staff? At least bring Ole Potter and come. Bring Ole Potter and come. And few of his coaching crew, why some of the chess sisters they are walking behind people that have seen success before. But this one, no, 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 no. Instead, you you, you wipe all the people that was there. And look at where we are today. I know that everybody will say that we complain in lots that it will take time, success will take time. It's not in Chelsea. See, we are impatient. We are one people in this in the football world, it's most especially Premier League that are most we are the most we have the most impatient fans in the world. <sighs> now, after all ratification, now we are planning on building a a cooling room, like they say they call it chilling room for the players. That is after training, they have to chill and relax. Since because now chilling now, now they affect them not to play ball way. Yeah, I'm just I'm just tired. Even the Chelsea team self they make me sick. They make me tired. Because we just signed this Olodo. I they call put our Olo big Olodo. Just sign this Olodo called nothing, Sabi. Nothing. Very big fat Olodo like this. They call it, no, don't not nothing. As put to put I don't touch rubber cup before. Rubber cup, you don't touch them. Never touch her. Now he carry con Chelsea. Okay, if if now so why not bring Pochettino Muku manager? Mu no sin a person with the tactical. See my you match yesterday. See Eric Ten Hang yesterday. See taxis yesterday. See football change yesterday. Only in change itself if they get results instantly. See football yesterday. That is what we are talking about. They are saying that man, you face the same problem. Man, you face the same problem, but they have to sack, even though they gave some coaches long term contract. They have to sack till they got Eric Tengang. And Tengang is giving them results because Tengang wants money to go back to that glory man you they know as before. That club that used to carry trophy, that club that don't miss uh, the premiership. Then this set of, I don't, I don't know where they bring them from. Say they buy clubs, say they want to build club. What do you want to build when the club don't carry everything? Did they tell you that Chelsea was struggling? Chelsea was not struggling. Just come club, disorganize everything. So guys, that will be all for now. Like I told you people before, Andre Santos did not put through again to Palmeiras. He's still pending. Then Chelsea are looking forward and signing a 15-year-old wonder kid, Ecuador wonder kid, a midfielder from um, Ecuador. Chelsea want to sign that guy. But they say he go only come play when he don't reach 18 years. Now he go fit come play. You understand? His name is Kenji Pierce. Then also Chelsea are trying to follow the full step of building Chelsea in the format of the way the same format they use in building Dodgers that's the step they want to use in building Chelsea like I said before I don't know what they are building and even if they are building not with Potter Potter is not the right man, man for this kind of job you understand so guys that'll be all for now do it to like our video share and most importantly don't forget to subscribe to this channel thank you very much